So can we build smarter people using AI? What would it mean if we could literally build smarter people? Uh, it is terrifying. I don't know if we're ever going to have artificial intelligence that is as smart or smarter than us, but it is inevitable that we will have people that are artificially smarter than other people. AI is this amazing technology. It will make us better. It will take the doctors and make super doctors. Teachers become super teachers. Everyone becomes better. We call this augmented intelligence. And it is truly a beautiful world, and I'm all in. But that's the bait. The overwhelming economic trend of the last 30 years is, I have an AI that can do diagnoses? Why am I paying for this expensive doctor? Why don't we hire a lab tech, give them the AI? I can hire three lab techs for the price of one doctor. That's called deprofessionalization. So we can do augmentation, or we can do deprofessionalization. It's totally valid choices. One comes with a great deal more work, but the other is a dead end race to the bottom. And then you have to think, what is left of what I do that is actually truly valuable? I would argue that the value we have, all of us, is our creative potential. And when I say creative, I don't mean painting pictures or making movies per se. Uh, I'm a scientist. That's creative work. I'm exploring the unknown. It's not what university you went to or what skills you have. It's not the test scores you got in school. Um, it's these qualities, and we call them meta-learning. Uh, learning how to learn. Because the one thing I know about the future of work is that it's unknown. So what we need to do is build people for the unknown. Today, the single best spend on artificial intelligence is putting expensive university trained professionals like you out of a job. If you don't learn how to do more than what you're told, then someone like me is going to end your whole career. <laughs>